The M24 Chaffee, officially light tank, M24, is an American light tank used during the later part of World War II. It was also used in post-World War II conflicts including the Korean War, and by the French in the war in Algeria and the First Indochina War. In British service it was given the service name Chaffee after the United States Army General Adna R. Chaffee, Jr., who helped develop the use of tanks in the United States Armed Forces. M24s were mostly removed from U.S. and NATO armies by the 1960s, but remained in service with some Third World countries. Topic. Development and production history British combat experience in the North African campaign identified several shortcomings of the M3 Stuart light tank, especially the performance of its 37mm cannon. A 75mm gun was experimentally fitted to a howitzer motor carriage M8 and M3 tank with a larger turret, and trials indicated that a 75mm gun on the M5 light tank development of the M3 was possible. The M3, M5 design was dated though, the 75mm gun reduced storage space, and the armor was insufficient. The T7 light tank design, which was initially seen as a replacement, grew in weight to more than 25 short tons taking it out of the light tank classification, and so was designated as the medium tank M7. The weight increase without increased power gave it unsatisfactory performance. The program was stopped in March 1943 to allow standardization on a single medium tank, the M4 medium. This prompted the Ordnance Committee to issue a specification for a new light tank, with the same powertrain as the M5A1 but armed with a 75mm gun. In April 1943, the Ordnance Corps, together with Cadillac, who manufactured the M5, started work on the new project, designated Light Tank T24. The power plant and transmission of the M5 were used together with some aspects of the T7. Efforts were made to keep the weight of the vehicle under 20 tons. The armor was kept light, with the glasses plate only 25 mm thick but sloped to maximize effectiveness. A new lightweight 75 mm gun was developed, a derivative of the gun used in the B-25H Mitchell bomber. The gun had the same ballistics as the 75mm M3 in use by American tanks but used a thinly walled barrel and different recoil mechanism. The design featured 16 in 41 cm tracks and torsion bar suspension, similar to the slightly earlier M18 Hellcat tank destroyer, which itself started in production in July 1943. The torsion bar system was to give a smoother ride than the vertical volute suspension used on most U.S. armored vehicles. At the same time, the chassis was expected to be a standard used for other vehicles, such as self-propelled guns, and specialist vehicles, known together as the light combat team. It had a relatively low silhouette and a three man turret. On October 15, 1943, the first pilot vehicle was delivered. The design was judged a success and a contract for 1,000 was immediately raised by the Ordnance Department. This was subsequently increased to 5,000. Production began in 1944 under the designation Light Tank M24. It was produced at two sites, from April at Cadillac and from July at Massey Harris. By the time production was stopped in August 1945, 4,731 M24s had been produced. Topic. Service history The M24 Chaffee was intended to replace the aging and obsolete light tank M5 Stuart, which was used in supplementary roles. The first 34 M24s reached Europe in November 1944 and were issued to the U.S. 2nd Cavalry Group mechanized, in France. These were then issued to Troop F, 2nd Cavalry Reconnaissance Squadron and Troop F, 42nd Cavalry Reconnaissance Squadron, which each received 17 M24s. 
During the Battle of the Bulge in December 1944, these units and their new tanks were rushed to the southern sector. Two of the M24s were detached to serve with the 740th Tank Battalion of the U.S. First Army. The M24 started to enter widespread use in December 1944, but they were slow in reaching the frontline combat units. By the end of the war, many armored divisions were still mainly equipped with the M3, M5 Stuart. Some armored divisions did not receive their first M24s until the war was over. Aside from the U.S. Army, the British Army was another user of the Chaffee, with at least several hundred obtained through the U.S. Lend-Lease program. These saw action mainly in northwestern Europe and the North German Plain where British forces saw action against German troops. Reports from the armored divisions that received them prior to the end of hostilities were generally positive. Crews liked the improved off-road performance and reliability, but were most appreciative of the 75mm main gun, which was a vast improvement over the 37mm. The M24 was inferior to German tanks, but the bigger gun at least gave its crews a much better chance to fight back when it was required. The M24's light armor made it vulnerable to virtually all German tanks, anti-tank guns, and handheld anti-tank weapons. The contribution of the M24 to winning the war in Europe was insignificant, as too few arrived too late to replace the worn-out M5s of the armored divisions. In the Korean War, M24s were the initial U.S. tanks directed to combat the North Korean T-34-85s. The occupation troops in Japan from which the tanks were drawn were inexperienced and under-equipped due to rapid demobilization after World War II. The M24 fared poorly against these better armed, better armored, and better crewed medium tanks, losing most of their number while inflicting only minor damage on the T-34 units. Managing a fighting withdrawal, they ended up as artillery in the Pusan perimeter. In August, reinforcements from the U.S. and the Commonwealth brought heavier tanks that could easily dispatch the T 34s. M 24s were more successful later in the war in their reconnaissance role, supported by heavier, more capable tanks such as the M 4 Sherman, M 26 Pershing, and M 46 Patton. Like other successful World War II designs, the M24 was supplied to many armies around the globe and was used in local conflicts long after it had been replaced in the U.S. Army by the M41 Walker Bulldog. France employed its M24s in Indochina in infantry support missions, with good results. They employed 10 M24s in the Battle of Dien Bien Phu. In December 1953, ten disassembled chaffees were transported by air to provide fire support to the garrison. They fired about 15,000 shells in the long siege that followed before the Viet Minh forces finally overcame the camp in May 1954, almost all being entirely worn out and badly damaged by the time the battle was over. France also deployed the M24 in Algeria. Some chaffees are known to have been passed down to the Army of South Vietnam, where they saw service at least until the Battle of Hue. The last time the M24 is known to have been in action was in the Indo-Pakistani War of 1971, where 66 Pakistani chaffees stationed in East Pakistan today's Bangladesh were lost to Indian Army T-55s, PT-76s, and anti-tank teams, being easy prey for the better equipped invading Indian forces. Although both Iran and Iraq had M24s prior to the Iran-Iraq War, there is no report of their use in that conflict. South Korean chaffees saw limited service during the Korean War, often performing hit-and-run raids on communist forces. Also, Cambodia, Laos, Japan and Taiwan were four other Asian nations to have operated chaffees aside from South Vietnam, South Korea and Pakistan. The Greek Army received 85 M24s from USA from 1950 till 1970. The M24s initially were organized in two tank regiments numbered 392, 393. In later years the tank regiments were reorganized in tank battalions with the same numbers. 
From 1962 till the early 70s the M24s in tank battalions were replaced with M47s and the M24s were used to equip independent reconnaissance companies with an additional 121 M24s received from Italy in 1975. From 1991 till 1995 61 M24s were scrapped due to CFE treaty limitations. The rest are abandoned in or outside military camps and one M24 is preserved in the Greek Army Tank Museum. Chaffees appear in two war movies, The Bridge at Ramagan and The Battle of the Bulge. In each case the Chaffees are being used to represent the heavier M4 Sherman. The tanks used in the Battle of the Bulge were borrowed from the Spanish Army. Topic. Variants and related vehicles Light Tank T-24 Original Prototype. Tested at Aberdeen Proving Grounds in January 1944 was eventually standardized as Light Tank M24, Light Tank T24E1 prototype with Continental R975C4 engine and Spicer torque converter transmission. One vehicle was converted from the original T24 prototype and tested in October 1944. The vehicle had superior performance compared to the M24, but suffered from transmission reliability problems. M19 multiple gun motor carriage developed from T65 40mm GMC anti aircraft gun on extended M5 chassis. Lengthened M24 hull with engine moved to center, twin 40mm Bofors anti aircraft guns mounted at hull rear. 336 rounds. 904 were ordered in August 1944, but only 285 were completed by the end of the war. M37 105mm howitzer motor carriage developed in 1945. Carried a 105mm howitzer M4, 126 rounds. Was intended to replace the 105mm howitzer motor carriage M7. 448 ordered, 316 delivered. Saw service in the Korean War, M41 howitzer motor carriage Gorilla engine moved to the center of hull, 155 mm howitzer M1 mounted at rear. 250 ordered, 85 produced. Saw service in the Korean War, with some exported to France at 77 multiple gun motor carriage hod 6.50 12.7 mm caliber machine guns mounted in a new design turret, T-42, T-43 cargo tractors based on the T-33, the T-42 had a torque converter transmission from the M-18 Hellcat. The M43 was a lightened version of the T42. T9 had bulldozer kit installed. Additionally, the M38 Wolfhound prototype armored car was experimentally fitted with an M24 turret. Topic: <laughs> Foreign variants. Topic: NM116 In 1972, the Norwegian Army decided to retain 54 of their 123 M24 light tanks as reconnaissance vehicles after they were substantially rebuilt under the designation NM116. It was calculated that the NM116 rebuilding program cost only about a third as much as contemporary light tanks. This program was managed by the firm Thune Eureka. The American firm Napco developed an improved power pack based around the 6V53T diesel engine used in the M113 armored personnel carrier mated to an Allison MT653 transmission. The original 75mm gun M6L-39 was replaced with a French D-925 90mm low-pressure gun, with a coaxial 0.50-inch M2 heavy machine gun. The bow gunner position was eliminated in favor of ammunition stowage. A new fire control system was installed, complete with a Simrad LV-3 laser rangefinder. 
Norwegian firms also converted eight M24 light tanks into light armoured recovery vehicles to support the NM116. The NM116 were retired from service in 1993. Other variants The Chilean army upgunned their M24s in the mid 1980s to the EMI OTO 60 mm hyper velocity medium support HVMS gun with roughly comparable performance to a standard 90 mm gun. Chile operated this version until 1999. Uruguay continues to use the M24, modernized with new engines and 76mm guns which can fire armor-piercing, fin-stabilized, discarding Sabot APFSDS rounds. In the mid-1950s, in an attempt to improve the anti-tank performance of the vehicle, some French M24s had their turrets replaced with those of the AMX-13 light tank. AMX-13 variants with Chaffee turret also existed. Topic. Operators Former operators Austria 46 M20 FAS in active service from 1956 till 1966. Turrets of retired M24 tanks were fixed in Austrian bunker systems. Purchased through NATO. Bangladesh 10 second-hand M24 Chaffee light tanks from the Pakistan Army in 1971. Belgium 224 were bought through NATO. Cambodia 36 were purchased. Canada-32 purchased by the Canadian government in 1947 along with 294 M4A2E8 76mm Shermans. Chile. Denmark 63 were bought through NATO. Ethiopia 34 were purchased. France 1254 vehicles were purchased through NATO. Greece 170 were bought through NATO. Iran 180 were purchased. Iraq 78 were purchased. Italy 518 were bought through NATO. Japan entered service in 1952, last ones taken out of service by 1974. Laos, four were purchased. Netherlands, about 50 in use until 1962. Norway 123 entered service in the 1950s, last Chaffees were taken out of service in 1993. Pakistan 132 were purchased. Philippines, seven Chaffees assigned to the Recon Company of the 10th BCT -E during the Korean War. Two known were on static display in Lingayan, Pangasinan. Portugal 16 were bought through NATO. South Korea 30 Chaffees were used for training in the early 1950s for a short period of time, later delivered to Taiwan. Saudi Arabia 52 were purchased. South Vietnam 137 were purchased. Spain 31 were purchased through NATO. Used during IFNI war. Thailand 118 were purchased. Republic of China. Turkey. 238 were bought through NATO. United Kingdom 302 were purchased. Uruguay 17 upgraded, retired from the armored infantry and replaced by 25 M41C recently donated from Brazil. United States Soviet Union, bought two M24s through Lend-Lease. See also List of M Series military vehicles G numbers